Are you afraid of setting goals? Been there, done that, felt the exact same way. Actually, I have a lot of clients who also tell me that there is a little bit of fear about setting goals. Sometimes it's the fear of failure, it's the fear of success, and it paralyzes us. Sometimes we get so wrapped up, analysis by paralysis per se, and we're diving into all these goals and making it really more specific and more terrific and all the things that you tell us, Coach Becca, to do. And then we don't execute. We know what we need to do, but we don't execute to our dead level best. I've done it, done it millions of times. Let's be honest. I've set some really high goals before, recently even, and I didn't hit it. Sucks, doesn't it? So here are a couple things that I know deep in my gut, if I really want to make sure we are overcoming this fear around goals and something that I did personally this year to help me with my 2024 goals, here's some things that I did to simplify it. So first thing I've done is kiss. Keep it simple, sister, right? I'm just keeping it as simple as I possibly can. The more that I complicate it, the more things that I need to to track and I've got spreadsheets and all of this stuff. Let me tell you, by March, I'm not tracking like I probably need to. That's why I love having my accountability buddies because we figured a simple way for me to keep it very simple, keeping my activities very simple. Two, speaking of activities, just knowing what are the activities that you need to do to make sure you're going to hit your vision or your mission or to get you still rolling. If you watched one of my links, we'll put it in the description below too, about setting goals and are you one who set goals and one who doesn't. If you don't set goals, you know, just knowing what are the things that you need to do on a daily, weekly, monthly basis to make sure you're moving forward, that you're not stagnant, that we're not complacent. And then the third thing is one, we just need to be prepared. Are you prepared? Do you have the knowledge and the resources to be able to reach where you want to go. And if you're not prepared, then let's go ahead and let's get prepared. That also comes with, you know, sometimes, you know, there are three reasons why people have fear. One is they're just not prepared. So we need to make sure we're prepared. Another thing we just need to make sure that we're doing and that I've been able to do as well, is we have knowledge. So one of the reasons for fear is lack of knowledge. So this fear comes from a place of truly not knowing what to do. So if he, I know what to do, I've got it set in place. If we've got the knowledge, we've, we've we're prepared, we've got confidence, right? The third reason for fear is lack of confidence. So if we've got those three things, you know, and we've made it really simple and we know where we want to go, we know the things that we want to accomplish and we know the activity that needs to be done, we're going to have an amazing year. So keep it simple. Know the activities you need to do on a daily, weekly, monthly basis. Make sure you have the knowledge, know what you need to be doing, be prepared. And four, deep down, believe that you can overcome all the challenges that might get in your way of achieving your greatness. Until next time, make it a wonderful and blessed day.